Howdy folks, welcome back to Survivor Craft. I'm the Tall Turtle, and today we are going to work on our northern hot springs area. I'm just having a midnight snack up here at the Rooftop Cafe, and I noticed a little... Oh, we can do zoom. A little block that I should turn into dirt right above my head, but I won't do that today. I'm also noticing all the farming I need to do, but that'll be done off camera. So, we are going to run down, and I forgot one thing, I got all my stuff together for hot springs, but I forgot signs, so we're going to run down and grab signs together, and um, let's see who else is on with us tonight. Quite a crew, it is midnight on a Saturday night, central time, IRL, and even though I was on the server alone for the past several days, whenever I was playing, um, and I was just checking the server activity, just for fun when it wasn't playing and there's nobody on. We have quite a crew tonight, so it's nice to see this many people. Unfortunately, I don't have anything planned with people, although tonight would be a great night because look at all that. But we're going to do our own thing. And um, I'm just going to grab some signs. We're going to build our hot springs. I think I only need three, but we'll do four. Um, how do we want to do this? Let's go underground today. In fact, no, let's not even. Let's, well, not, I meant this underground. But let's do this underground. Through the mine, I'll show you what I've been doing. I've been doing a lot of my branch mine off camera. And I'll just show you quickly what I've been doing here. And, um, see, there we go. I've also decided to go out this direction, which means I can go down and have branches to see this direction of branch. I can also go out that way then, this direction from here, if I wanted to expand. That's just something I can do. But anyway, lots of good materials. And I realized at the end of this, looking down, that there's a dungeon down there. So we'll do that together. All the dungeons aren't that big of a deal. But um, we will consider doing that. Oops, I did not take the steps. Oh, look at that. It is sunrise. Perfect timing to work on hot springs. I have not done anything off camera since the last Survivor Craft video. So nothing to fill you in on at all. I haven't done anything other than gather materials. So we are just going to build our hot springs, decide how this is going to work. So these things sticking up. Ooh, we need some light here somehow. We'll figure that out when we add lighting to this area. So this is just outlining my hot springs. So um, I was thinking... This would be the same level as this. And then this would be up one or two. So this is just a border telling me what I wanted, roughly what I wanted to do for my springs. Um, there should be, yeah, there's gonna be stuff down there. Um, but the water's actually gonna go down here. So what we need to do is carefully cut this out. I'm gonna leave that by the water there. And then what we're gonna do we're going to make sure our torches are off to the side. There we go, like that, so that we don't accidentally make this dark in here. And then the water level is actually going to be on this. So this is going to come out here, and this is going to be... Um, whoops, hang on. No, that's fine, actually. We just need a torch in there. What? That's not... Why is that even anything? There. That can stay, though. This needs to be soul sand. Because this... Oh, no, it's going to rain. Oh, I'm just going to turn that grass. I don't want that to be grass. Um, because this is what the hot spring is all about, right? And then we're just going to leave... That like that. It's not all going to be... Soul sand. And then this isn't going to be here. That's just like a marker for myself. And same with the side. This is not going to be here. That's just a marker for myself. And then water is going to fill in. In these three spaces. But it's going to be a little more... Can't take water out of there. No, it's not going to work that way. I need to actually find renewable source for this, don't I? Which we'll have in a second here. There we go. There we go. 
Because this, I don't want to be moving. That can be moving, but not the hot spring area where people will hang out. Actually, that's fine, isn't it? No, nope, we need another block. Where can I get that to stop moving? There we go. See? Nice, just like a plant. Okay, good. And then we'll have, you know, stuff around the side. Like, we're not going to have seating or anything. I thought about doing benches, but this is going to be more natural. So we're going to have trees and grass, and we're going to do the a lot of the glowstone with leaves around it in this whole area. Make it look very natural. So now for the upper one here... Give me a little waterfall. Do I want to raise one or do I actually want to raise two like this? Um, I think I do want it to be raised two. So what we need to do, that means this will be... Um, what are we going to do with that one? Uh, that means this will be our layer here. I hope I have enough soul sand for all that. It doesn't need all be soul sand, I guess. Um, you do need to fill it in so I can see what I need to do. This will be the waterfall part. And then it'll step down. Let's see, we got 34 left. Let's see, what can we do with 34 soul sand? Actually, we can probably pretty much fill this in, can't we? Yeah, we can fill this in, so let's do that. Um, there we go. Good. And this will be the top. Uh, let's see. I think we're just going to go like that there. Then come out. So then this can become soul sand here. And I think I will make that dirt there. So this all needs to be filled out something like that. Whoops, we need to come out again here. Like so, there we go. Yeah, I think that'll work. And then we'll have some stuff like this. And then maybe add some things here for some trees. I brought plenty of dirt. Oh, I really hate this rain. I just don't like rain in Minecraft. I just, it just really bothers me. So let's see. Um, all that stayed, right? That didn't turn to grass again, did it? No. Okay. Um, let's look at some detail things. How are we going to get people here? I don't really think of that. Like, how are we going to get people here? <laughs> like, there's no path or anything. So anyway, we need... A spot for the water to come down. So can we go like this? How will that look? Well, that's a shovel, not a bucket. So if I start filling all this water in, and again, it's going to be still at top, but then there'll be a waterfall coming down. So let's make a renewable water source. That's not enough blocks. Renewable water source. We need to do it over there, really. But shoot, I still don't have one. Um. Can I please get a renewable water source? Is that going to work? No. Oh my gosh. Hang on, I'll get this. Alright, it's still, but we want... Do we want the waterfall like that? Or should we... Oh, never mind. We're not going to make it go more. That's just how it's going to be. Good. I like that. A lot. Let me fill my bucket back up. Alrighty, so I like that a lot. Now I just have to decide um, how we want it to look. So we're going to put in no lamps here. It's going to be all hidden lighting and trees. I'm going to force the trees to grow. I think I want to make the trees grow um, on the same level. So for this, we do need it too thick all the way around. There we go. So now, let's force in a bunch of trees. So I'm hoping I'm getting the hang of this tree thing here. And I can just force in 
bunch of trees. Whoa, there we go. That's gonna work. Let's do another one here. Hey! Yay, good. I'm excited. This is working out. Alright, we're almost done, except I'm stuck. <laughs> so let's try this here. Do I want another tree. Oh, geez. Do I want another tree? There's gonna be more trees behind it, too, but. Um. Kind of wanted trees. Let's see. I think I'll wait on the trees till I finish the outside. So, first of all, we need to get some more blocks in here. You know what? No, we're going to. We'll come back to the blocks. I'm going to do this layer by layer so I don't forget anything. So, let's get back up here. I don't know how I'm going to get in here, though. We're just going to have to swim in, and then it's going to bounce us everywhere. There we go. That works. Okay. Um. We need to light this up. So my plan to light this up. Gosh, I almost feel like I should put coarse dirt around the outside. Or something. So it's not grass. Um, well, let's just do one thing first. Let's do our lighting and our hedges. And then we'll work on it from there. But I have to do it from the outside. But then I have to see it from the inside. So this will be interesting, I think. Okay, I think I got what I wanted. Lights in there, then there's hedges all around. Light level doesn't drop below 12 at all. Oh, that didn't turn to grass under there. I guess we'll keep it. All right, so this is all good here. So let's try to figure out this side. This is very difficult to do. I was kind of guessing where I wanted things to go. Oh, right. I think that'll take care of that. Let me try to get this. So how does it look? You're in the hot spring. There really isn't any place to hang out. Yeah, there is. Good. Now, lighting this shall be really good in here. Like I said, I thought about changing some of these out to coarse dirt. Maybe? Maybe? No. I'd have to do them all like that, I think, if I started doing this. Um, I mean, it doesn't look bad. Maybe I will, because having a grass looks too clean, I think. Yeah, so I think changing all these out actually did, does look pretty good, if you ask me. Um, it does give it a sense of, like, nature and use. I also think that one needs to have a block in there. Can I go over there? I want to put a block in right there. No, I don't. That looks terrible. Get rid of that. And we need to replace this one then, I think, as well. There we go. And how about these down here? Yes, good. So little details that no one will notice, but if they weren't there, you wouldn't notice. So there we go. Good. Oh, lately, oh, people are dropping like flies. Alrighty, so what do we need to do? A few more details to fix here, perhaps. There we go, and then back to regular dirt. Okay. Oh, night's coming. I already slept, so that's okay. All right, what are we going to do? We got the trees done. We got the hedge done. We got the inside done. That's just going to float for a while. The upper hot spring is done. Lower hot spring is done. Except we need to figure out um, this border. Let's, let's do some of this here, though, too, I think. All right, there we go. So the hot spring peninsula looks like mud, sort of. And then it comes down. I don't really like that being so high, but it's blocking the light source. So that's just how it's going to be. Oh, yeah, I remember. We also need to have a way up there, don't we? We need to, like, crickety steps to get up. Um, I was going to put them like this. Steps that they made. Did I bring slabs? I didn't bring slabs. I guess there's just going to be steps. Um, okay. There'll just be steps that come up, and then it's up to you to figure out how you're going to get around there. <laughs> Let's get rid of that one. There we go. It's up to you to figure that out once you're up. So there's that. Um, what do we need to do then? Can I get rid of this one? I can, but now we need to keep the mud thing going, I think. If we get rid of that. There we go. The rest of this is going to be... Something like this, I think. 
Good. All right. So the last thing, or the last two things I need to do, three things I need to do, <laughs> I need to put on my lighting down here because we have some dark areas, bone meal the daylights out of it, and then figure out how we're going to get here. I was thinking a little footpath. Like a little bridge. But maybe there'll just be a path here that isn't very clear on purpose maybe through here right I think we'll do that um, which means I don't like those direct the direction of those stairs um, that'll be fine all right first of all let me get actually let's do the footpath first because we need to know where we're going and then we'll do the lighting so I think we'll do like a path that isn't obvious at first, right? Kind of need to know where you're going. Sorry, flowers. And there we go. Good, see? Little path. Not a big deal. Alright, good. So now let's put a sign up. There's going to be several signs, actually. Signage is very important. Notice, no armor-free bathing allowed. Please visit the Southern Hot Springs for an armor-free bathing experience. I've been thinking about that all day, like how to word that. I think it's hilarious. Alrighty, so we need to do lighting and bone meal. First, I have to decide, though, what is this light level here? Eight? Okay. Um, I need to decide, are we going to add more trees in here? Should I sneak in a few more trees? I like how it's really tight and private there. I kind of don't want more trees. Um, I don't. I don't think I want trees down here. I think I just want this to be bone meal. All right, so let me get my lighting in quick, and then we'll bone meal it together. And then I think, I think that'll make this area done. All right, I think we got all the lighting in the way I want it, for the most part. Actually, I think there's a spot over here. Um. That got kind of dark. Maybe not. All right, so let's bone meal this. And I just re whoop, and I just realized I have to figure out what I'm going to do with this whole section here. Maybe that'll just be flat green, like golf course cleanliness, like this is here. You know, like a lawn. Or else add some trees. Gosh, I don't know. Let's bone meal this first, though, and then we'll think about it. See how this works. Okay, if this wants to be tall grass, it can be tall grass in this section. Uh, not that much tall grass. That's too much tall grass. All right, so far so good. I guess I can live with some of that. That might be too much tall grass, though. Let's work this direction before we get trapped in here. Oh, come here. Let's see. How's that going to be? Um, that should be fine. There we go. I like that. And I like that. And that. And is this ever going to change out? There we go. There we go. Oh, that looks good. That looks good. And then, last but not least, back up there. Good. There we go. So the hot spring section is done. Very nice. You can walk through here. And you have to go like this. I think we might actually... Should we put a little sign up here that says Hot Springs? Do we need one? Just because it's so difficult to find. Kind of a tight fit here, though. I don't... You know, I don't think we're going to put a sign. I think it's just going to be... You kind of have to know. Kind of be looking for it. All right, so that section of the phase two is done. See how we're working right along? We're so close to being done with this. We've got what I was going to do as a gazebo over here, but I might just do a children's playground. I might just do a children's playground here. Well, there's a hot, so hard northern hot springs that started. Oh, hang on. I see an issue here. There we go. That started as... Oh, hang on. More. I want to do more of that. Started as natural, but then they kind of, you know, 
humanized it a little bit. So the only question now is what am I going to do with this green space? Because I like how it's open. I really do. And I like the idea of having glowstone in the middle or in the, in the ground like this. Like this would be the front lawn of the building and keeping it, you know, you can see it then from wherever you are. You can see the organ house and then from the organ house you can see out, right? But I also like the idea of putting a bunch of trees, to be honest. So I think what we're going to do quickly to finish this project is we're going to do this section with trees and then hidden lights because the beach is a separate video, the gazebo or playground is a separate video, and then that stuff over there is going to be a separate video. I also decided my polar bear exhibit is going to be in that corner that we haven't actually looked at very much. I don't know how I'm going to do it because i got to make packs and I can't remember. So let's quickly put in some trees. And then we'll probably have to go back and um, get some more lighting supplies. But let's see. Let's put in a couple trees here. Not a whole lot. I'm not going to go nuts. It's not going to be super dense. There are just going to be a few trees. Kind of like how it would have been had I not... Hello? Am I too close to something? Good grief. Just like it would have been had I not destroyed the land before I um, rebuilt it. So, let's put a tree. Gosh, let's see. Let's put a tree. Alrighty, there we go. That looks good. That's enough trees. Um, so now we just need to put in our hidden lighting which I'm going to use oak leaves mainly. Um, we need a lot of hidden lighting. So I'll put one there. Let's put one in here. Let's throw one back here. Let's throw another one back here. Again, there will be spawnable blocks, but I don't really care. Because the chances are still very low, even if there's a spawnable block. There we have that. But because I want the fallen leaves to be contiguous, I'm going to just add some more of these in here. I think. There we go. So let's first of all get rid of these five. Put these like that. There we go. There's one. Um, that works. That works. There we go. There we go. Make sure they're all covered. I'm not forgetting any of them. And um, I don't like that so much. And last but not least, there we go. Do we want to bone meal that? I think we do, but not very heavy as I make it heavy. <laughs> we can't forget about back there. How am I going to get back there? Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. Um, if I stay under a tree, it looks like we're not going to get doubles. So that's good. Let's see. There we go. Getting back here first, and then work my way around this way. Kick you out of there. No doubles up here. No doubles up here, I said. Nope. No, no, no. Good grief. Six left. Make them count. Ooh, I kind of like how that's open. Maybe I don't. Get out of here, doubles. Three left. Make them count. It's a waste when it's all doubles. Too many doubles. I think that's good. There we go. I think it's good. I think we did it. So now our base is all done up until this area. Wow, I love it. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this is turning out so nicely. Look at that. Oh my gosh, my northern hot springs. I love it. My tree house. My organ house. My beach. So, next up, we're going to... Ooh, let's get some torches in here for now until we 
get this built up. Either a playground or a gazebo. And the reason why I don't mind a playground being here is because of real life, back when I was a stay-at-home dad with two tiny children, we would go to different playgrounds all the time. And you would be surprised, maybe you wouldn't be surprised, how dangerous some of them were. There'd be playgrounds where at the edge of the playground was like a retaining wall, like a 5-foot or 10-foot drop. Or there'd be next to a lake where the playground went up to the lake or up to a busy road. It was just crazy. <laughs> the playground was nice, but there's no border and it just spilled out into danger. So that's why I don't mind having a playground here. So I might do like a jungle gym here, maybe. Or I'll just do a gazebo. Can't decide. And then we'll do a beach. Very simple. Just towels. And then that leaves... This spot over here, I want to get rid of all the torches. So basically this isn't going to have any builds or anything. It's just going to be lighting somehow. Or maybe I'll do some kind of build. I haven't decided if I'm going to do any types of builds up there. And then we have to do these hot springs. These will be the armor free or armor optional hot springs. We're going to have three separate hot springs with wood in between and keep this hill. Kind of like a little cove back here. Romantic. And then back here will be our polar bear exhibit. There'll be like a little path through here and then a polar bear exhibit back here. I just don't know what I'm going to do. How I'm going to do it. i got to figure out how the snow and ice work. And then over here, this will be like a little restroom. So exhibit, restroom, hot springs, lighting. Those four things. Note to self. Those four things for this section. Polar bear exhibit with a beaten path. Hot springs, restroom, lighting. Was that five things or four things? I'm tired. It's way too late. It's well after midnight. I don't know what I just said. Off the catch and editing to write it down. All right. So that is it for me. I'm just going to run around. That's going to be my outro running around because I can. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I enjoyed it so very much making this video for you. And I cannot wait until I make the next several coming up on episode 200 faster than you think. And I'll catch you next time.